Previously on the Emerald Chronicles. <gasps> no way. It, it, it can't be. I, I... I... I don't believe this. Ren is the leader? Isaac, are you okay? How could you? Greetings to all of you loyal followers. Tonight is the start of our big plan. To eliminate all superhumans! Join me, Rand Summers, on a journey to reclaim what's rightfully ours! Rand... My friend... What have you done? I'm tired of fighting this pointless revolution. Humans against superhumans? It's just... Makes no sense what you're trying to do. Maybe to you it's pointless. But to me, it's very meaningful. Why? Why do something this despicable? Because it's what I desire, Isaac. A world where humans aren't guarded by superhumans who think it's their duty to protect us. We're not defenseless and refuse to be oppressed by the superhuman society any longer. So I decided to exterminate anyone who calls themselves a superhuman and cleanse this world. So by cleanse, you mean mass genocide? You're willing to kill millions of innocent lives simply because they're superhuman? <laughs> Sounds fun, right? My first attempt at this ended abruptly, but thanks to a second chance at life, I was able to slowly prepare all of this in secret. <gasps> first attempt? Okay, now I'm curious. I demand you remove your mask. Show me your face. If you insist, old friend. <laughs> Here I am, Isaac. Do you remember me now? It's... it's... Ren! But how? You seem shocked. <laughs> I don't blame you. It's amazing that I'm here talking to you while fulfilling my lifelong goal. This can't be... You should be dead. I saw you fall to your death 15 years ago. How are you alive? Enough chit-chat, Ninja Freak. I'm done talking to you. Let's continue our little scuffle, shall we? Very well. But when I win, I demand to know how you were able to come back to life. I shall add that to the wager. Fine. Add whatever you want. But I doubt you'll be alive at the end of this fight. <laughs> Our first objective is to kill the president of Super Central. We'll use his sudden death as a martyr. 
He'll be an example of what's to come for all of those superhuman scum. We'll take over the city and demonstrate just how powerful of a revolution we can be. Who's with me? Ren... <sighs> Isaac, wait! Alright, let's begin. <sighs> Ren... Isaac? <laughs> so glad you could make it. This is what you were doing when going out for a walk? You're trying to turn humans against superhumans! What the hell were you thinking? I'm surprised you're just figuring this out now. After all, you were the one who technically helped me in making this possible. What are you talking about? I had nothing to do with this! Really? You were the one who taught me martial arts, right? Well, thanks to you, I was finally able to defend not just myself, but also other humans as well. I began teaching my then growing loyal followers every technique you taught me for the past three years. You... You used me! Why? So I could further my own personal agenda. How else was I going to kill superhumans and start a revolution in secret? For three years I constantly killed random superhumans, built up a respectable reputation underground, and began garnering support for my cause. <laughs> So many superhumans suffered. I can hear their precious screams as I ripped them to shreds. You monster! Some of those slain superhumans were students of Santa Verde Academy. They were just kids, Ren! Like I care, young or old, they all must die. That includes you guys. You've disappointed me, Ren. I've created a monster out of you and it's imperative that I take you down! I can't believe it must come down to this, but it must be done! So be it, but not without a little fun first. Fellow supporters, it's time to show these two superhumans what we're made of! Catch me if you can! Isaac, don't just stand there! Go after him! But what about you? I'm Titanium Crusher, remember? I'll handle these supporters on my own. You go on ahead and take out Ren. Very well, then. I wish you the best of luck, Vandal. Same to you, Isaac. So you guys want to fight? Fine, then. Let's rumble. This is the end of the road for you, Ren. Surrender now! Hell no! You know how this works, Isaac. You and me are going to fight. <sighs> Fine. Shall we make another wager? You know it. If I win, you will die at my hands. But if I win, you must turn yourself in and end this revolution for good. You've got it. Now let's get this over with. Attack me if you dare. I will. <laughs> Gonna have to try a little harder than that. I'm not going down without a fight. Clearly. Well, neither am I. <laughs> You've improved immensely but at the cost of being a horrible excuse of a person. <sighs> I had a good master. He taught me well. <sighs> I thought I saw some good in you five years ago. I actually thought of for a second that I'd change your hatred and turn it into something greater. But I was wrong. So wrong. You thought you could change me, but it was a failed plan from the start. Superhumans have done nothing but ruin my life every step of the way. Just ask my deceased family, who were killed in cold blood right in front of me. My filthy superhuman scum. They left me alive in order for me to suffer and feel the pain of losing something valuable. Since that fateful day, I made a vow to kill all superhumans. Good or bad. Ren, 
I'm sorry for your loss and the pain you had to go through all these years. I now truly understand why you're against superhumans. But mass genocide won't help ease the pain. It'll only make things worse. Innocent lives will be lost if you decide to do this. <laughs> mass genocide. I prefer the term cleansing the world of poison. I'll never change my mind, Isaac. I'll never stop killing superhumans. Humans will take over Super Central. If you refuse to stop, then I'll have no choice but to kill you long before you kill another innocent life. Then you'll go against your stupid superhero code. You're not allowed to kill. True. There is, however, an exception to the rule. I am so sorry about this. Major death. This. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Ren. Cars, you, Isaac. I am so sorry. I... I had no choice. I'm so sorry! Isaac? Are you okay? What happened? He's dead. He's dead. I killed Ren. I'm so sorry. It didn't have to be this way! Ren! Please forgive me. I'm so, so, so sorry. <laughs> now it's time to end this fight. I believe you called that final blow Major Death Fist, right? <clears throat> you wouldn't. I would. Major Death <laughs> Lay another finger on him, and I'll end you! Well, if it isn't Vandal, long time no see. <gasps> Ren? I had a feeling you'd call for backup. Looks like we'll have to finish this fight another time. Soldiers, retreat! Ren is alive. How the hell is Ren alive? Uh, Isaac, you have no idea how much trouble you've put us all in. It's a good thing all of us have tracking devices. We wouldn't have to do this, Durak, if you had just stopped Isaac. But I'd lose. I don't care. You could have done something. Enough! Isaac is safe now, so let's drop the argument. Ronaldo, untie the kidnapped superhumans and take them back to the city. Jen and Durak will assist you. I take Isaac back to the academy. We'll talk later, Toshiro. Come on, you guys. Let's get these poor souls out of here. General Gannon. Yes, Master Tori. It's time to start the daily rapings. Kill every superhuman you see. As you wish, Master. Also, make sure you keep the students of Santa Verde Academy alive. You may only severely injure them. Yes, sir. Santa Verde is going to stay neutral, but for how long? <laughs> I'm going to crush Isaac's precious students along with every last superhuman in Super Central. And no one will be able to stop me!
My daughter hating me. Well, you did almost die, son. Very true. I shall fix this in the next episode. Subtlety, Mr. Winters. Subtlety. Next, next time, time, a father, father and, and daughter's, daughter's broken, broken bond. bond. See you guys next time on the Emerald Chronicles.